the goalless this afternoon to disallow goals it is a, a difficult surface wasn't it today? Yeah I think first and foremost thank you to Brick for hosting us um, it, was a, it was a tough surface for both teams um, key messages to get across the players look, like 90 minutes for some of you seven for us get skated through and skated and we've done that so, so it's a tick, up, um, tick for us so um, then yeah there were some good bits played and it's a fair big play the part in a good game. Um, so the conditions were a little bit um, frustrating at times trying to get the ball. Probably taking three touches and one would do. Um, that's just due to the nature of the, the pitch. So yeah, we said it was a game to adjust to, but the lads have come through very well. You said two disallowed goals, one offside, one uh, a foul. What were your thoughts on either of those? It, it, okay, I can't really see it because of line, but it looked like Fish made a good runner and I think Boyce just won the header. I don't think it's a lot of to us. By the by, it's a good workout from at least they're getting challenged. And I thought, I thought Brig were really physical as well. But lads are up to it, especially when you're playing a, a youngish, average age team. Um, but a lot of them did really well. Like I keep saying, there's no one guaranteed a starting position yet. I don't think people read into the fact that they've played 60 minutes, 70 minutes now, not mean that they're not part of the first team. It just means that everyone's getting equal minutes. So yeah, they've done well to persevere with the pitch and um, yeah, generally pleased with it. I say we're probably halfway stage in terms of fixtures now. How are you, how are you finding it so far? I think there's been some different challenges. Obviously, at Gainsborough is a little bit pitch is a little bit better than this, but um, we play a certain way. Even today, we had to adapt. Like we worked, with, we went a bit more direct into into fish and, and Carlton went off him. So we're just again just adapting to different conditions because we we know in, in the league we are we we are pitches that aren't as, as good as others. So. Again, it's good that the players have uh, adapted to it and not moaned, got on with it, and yeah, again, probably sure. How good is it to see that from the lads as well, particularly you know, Ross Parris missed one a couple of months ago to, to get back. I know obviously it's a different kind of atmosphere, isn't it, but still to get back and take one. He was the first one to say he'd have a penalty, so yeah, it's good confidence from him. Um, again, it's not as big a pressure, but yeah, it's good to see that we still can, uh, have a winning mentality. You know, um, and winning games of football. I know it's nil nil like that, but overall it's, a, it's another win. Um, so, I'm pleased with that effort application from the players. Uh, I like to say no injuries. Getting onto a 3G pitch on, on Tuesday, which is another test, isn't it? It is. Again, we, we train on 3G at the moment. Thank you to John Lake College. So um, players should be used to it. I, I'm looking for a, a true about from it. Um, so again, the, the team will be prepared properly for the game. Um, being um, training again, preparing. It'll be in before the start of the game on Tuesday as well to get the training session in. So again, it's all about fitness. Um, right now, again, we are sharpening little bits up. There's some really good little bits into play around the box. A couple of times we tried to walk the ball in, but yeah, good defending from Brig as well. And just finally, a couple of players not played today. Is there any issues there, or just try decisions to make 90 minutes and things like that? Yeah, a couple didn't play. Um, um, Will. He's a back stiff and up actually on the pitch. Um, we will not, but he'll be fine. Um, Danny and, and Cal just uh, managing minutes for them. Um, they did the work um, before the game and, and, and yesterday, so they're not missing any sort of um, physical output. We're just managing them, especially on a tricky pitch like this. And uh, you know, um, you have to look after players. This last one, Michael Kelly, how's he getting on? Yeah, he's nearly fit. He's going to train Monday, hopefully he'll be involved Tuesday, so it'll be a good run out on Tuesday against uh, Botsford. Um, but yeah, he's, he's, he's only got a slight point in his thigh, which certainly, which again, just came from a little bit of excessive sprint work we did. Um, a lot of players got through it, obviously, he's just felt it a little bit, so he's pulled him out to be, um, to be safe rather than um, in totally pull it. So we're, we're fine with that now. Kieran's doing a good job with him in the medical department, and so is Ash. So, He's not losing fitness, he's just striking the ball with the right foot, like he's just um, down. 